Hi guys, today I have a new video for you. So uh, this here is uh, one of uh, TP-Link's uh, smart light bulbs. It is called uh, LB130. Uh, this is a, a Wi-Fi LED light bulb. It's a 60 watt uh, model, and of course it is uh, RGB and uh, controllable via the, your Wi-Fi uh, network using your mobile device. Okay, so this is the light bulb, and this here is the the application for your smartphone. It is called Casa. So uh, this is how it looks. Uh, as you can see, you will need a, a TP-Link account in order to to be able to control the light bulb from outside your network, so from the internet through your home router, of course. And using this app, you can uh, you can set. Uh, the available TP-Link uh, smart devices. As you can see right here, I'm using right now uh, TP-Link uh, light bulb, the LB130, and one TP-Link uh, smart plug. I'm not going to show you how to use the smart plug at this point. We are only focusing on the light bulb. Also, you can add uh, more devices like uh, camera. Uh, there are also some um, some available scenes as you can see for for your light bulb of course okay, back and um, here you can see what you can do to to get a smart home so you can also buy a TP-Link smart home router if you want to and you can also uh, see the, the, the scheduled event. Ok, so let's move back to our devices and to our light bulb. Ok, so let's power it on. So, now it's on. Uh, you should know that uh, this is not uh, the default mode and the default color. Uh, it lights like this because I played with it earlier and this is uh, the color I uh, I left it on. Okay. So moving on. Here you can set the the color and of course the the light intensity. Okay. So this is how light intensity works. As you can see, this happens in real time. And of course, it's the same for for the color, as you can see. And you can go for even more colors here, like this. Or you can choose white. So. Here you can select the color temperature or you can go for auto white. Auto white basically will adjust the color temperature and light intensity according to the time of the day. Okay. Let's get back to colors. And back. Okay, so back to intensity level. And there are also presets you can use. So the auto white I showed you earlier, some preset color and intensity combination, also you can edit them 
as you can see. Also, you can set a schedule like this. So you, you can have uh, a preset schedule as you can see right here, or you can. Uh, Customize the the mode the light bulb will be using. I don't want to create any event right now, so I'm cancelling this and back. Okay. Also, there's a there's a usage log as you can see. So this is uh, my usage for today and for the past uh, seven days. And for the past uh, 30 days. I see there's no recording for energy consumption. I don't, I don't know why, but uh, as you can see, the the log uh, is is in order for for the time. And here you can uh, edit the device, so you can change the name, you can change the the, the icon here. Okay, so you can uh, choose the default state. Basically, if you unplug your your light bulb or turn it off and then back on uh, you you would want to to power on to last on state or whatever other available settings right here and the same for when you start it from the app okay also you can uh, change the time zone, so this is for the auto white function and below you will find the, uh, the device info ok let's play a little more this uh, nice uh, light bulb ok Lowering the, in the intensity and adjusting the color some more. Okay, so this is uh, pretty be pretty much about uh, everything you can do with this uh, TP-Link LB130 smart light bulb. Uh, in my opinion, it is a pretty interesting uh, and nice device. It uh, comes uh, with an affordable price, and um, it can uh, it can be used and set up uh, basically for any room in, in your home. Also, keep in mind that uh, in order to to set up and control this, uh, you will only need the light bulb. Uh, wi on Wi-Fi uh, wireless network and uh, mobile device, Android or uh, iPhone or iOS device. Okay, so thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and see you next time.